and welcome back to my channel so today's video is a little bit different we're doing kind of like a face cam type thing because they just announced the new game pack i guess i think it's a game pack for strangerville in the sims 4 which we have been so excited about they have been hyping it up the past few days or past day with the creepy stuff and i've been dying i've been living for it so about 12 minutes ago is when they announced it and i didn't do a reaction to it because i was impatient and could not wait but i figured that i would go to the video kind of pause it and talk about some things that I noticed because I have so many questions and then at the end just kind of give my opinion on the pack and you know what I think about it but before we get started let me just say sorry I'm at work which is why you have this nice little background right here I also look a mess um I'm pregnant so it's my skills um my my hair is brushed doesn't look like it it's actually like rainy today so my hair is frizzy so it's brushed though i promise um i don't have makeup on but anyways you know what take her to leave it this is me and we're just we're gonna talk about it we're gonna talk about the sims so that's what we're here for so anyways if you enjoy these kind of videos let me know but anyways that being said let's go ahead and get into the little trailer all right so i'm gonna slow the speed down a little bit um so I'm able to, so it's not going so fast, you know, so I can pause stuff without making a mess of this. Um, also, I muted it, so there's no music because I didn't want to get copyrighted. So, anyways, first things first, thing I notice is um, the RV in the background, which I saw in Simguro Kate's picture. I tweeted it yesterday, I was like, oh my god, is that an RV? But it looks like that RV may just be for decorations because um, apparently she's living in this nice little RV trailer that we can already kind of build. So, so far it doesn't look like RVs are actually functional, which I mean, whatever, fine. <laughs> I can deal with these little makeshift trailers, but the RV, it looks really cool. Okay, so apparently, um, I, they still haven't clarified if this is an army career. Um, and I'm hoping that it is. I'm thinking that just because of her outfit, we're going to get the military career, which is something that I am ecstatic about. I have been waiting and wanting the military career for so long. It's one of my favorite careers. We've had it in all generations of the game except The Sims 4, so I'm so excited to hopefully finally see that back. Looks like this chick here is, uh, this freaked me out. First time I watched it, I was like, what the hell? Um, that just looks like some crazy possessed crap that I'm not rolling with. <laughs> but it's like a picture of her and her friends. It's kind of like a movie, you know? I feel like I was watching a movie, like a trailer for a movie. That's why I have so many questions, because, um, because I, I don't know what's going on. They didn't give any titles, subtitles to tell us what's to come, but... Apparently one of her friends said, okay, Jess is in trouble, come help. So right here, this is Stranger Town, which I'm assuming is a world. I am hoping that it's a world that we can live in. It's like a new world, which I'm thinking it might be. I hope so. It would only make sense, but it looks so cool. Look at the big canyons and craters here. I really hope this isn't like a vacation road. I really... It, I mean, it looks like this is where they live. Like, this is like a military base um, world, which is really pretty. I really like it. So, fingers crossed, this is a new world. It looks like Sims are getting sick. See, we have, like, military people and the army tanks. And he's got that little test subject type little thing <laughs> on his head that I think it was Simgura Lindsay was wearing in her profile picture. He seems to be explaining something, um, and yeah, I, I don't know. There must be something going on, and she's freaking creepy looking, so she's probably like, girl, what is wrong with you? What kind of drugs did you take? I'm just kidding, but this little car right here, what is this? See, they keep giving all these cars to us in trailers, like in Get Famous. We had the limo drive by, and I freaked out thinking, oh my god, we're going to get cars. Well, now we have these army vehicles. We have these little vans. 
And are we gonna get cars eventually? That's the question I have, but that's really cool. Don't know what that is. I don't know if that's, it looks like she was inside of it in just a second. Um, well, no, that's, no, just kidding. This She's not in the car. She was in a bedroom. So that looked, let me go back a little bit here. It looks like um, a new kind of device. That's something that I haven't seen before. So maybe something to do with the new career, the military career or something like that. And here are the <laughs> creepy possessed looking Sims. We have a crash site. Um, which kind of reminds me of the spaceship crash site in Strange Town, but this also reminds me of the new show Manifest. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but their plane didn't crash, but basically you can go look it up. Um, they went through some turbulence, and when they landed, they landed like, what was it, five years into the future, and they have like these special powers. So, I mean, I'm kind of getting that kind of vibe from the crash site. That's my first little impression there. We have some new gadgets. I don't know what they're doing, but I see the RV back there. Um, oh, hold on. Let me go back. This right here, I don't, this, I was going to say this looks like an astronaut thing, but it looks like a quarantine type mask thing and quarantine outfit you know kind of gives me um stranger things vibes you know because in stranger things you know all the crazy stuff was growing and they had to be quarantined and put that stuff on or it would get on them and like affect them in some way so that's really cool we have some like strange plants um i don't know what he's wearing i don't know what they're doing they look possessed we have some like secret agents which Everybody's been saying Area 51 vibes, and this right here kind of confirms it because everybody says that the government is kind of covering up Area 51 and the strange things that are reportedly happening there. So that's really cool to see, like, some FBI, CIA, CIA agents or something like that kind of protecting the secret of what's going on. I don't know what that is, but that's pretty cool. I mean, I just have so many questions. So many. I don't know where they're going. I don't know. I don't have so many questions. Uh, that looks like the shadow of the like mother thing, which I still don't know what mother is, but she just sunk down. What is that? What is that? <laughs> I just I have so many questions, you guys. But anyways, that's all that they gave us. No really explanation, but... It does say available February 26th, so we don't have very, very, I can't speak, very much longer to wait, which is really good. We have like six days left, so I can wait. I can wait six days, but I'm thinking that possibly they're going to give us some more information, kind of answer some more questions because, oh my God, yeah. So basically, that's it. Let me zoom back in here to me. Um, hi, let's talk. That was pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. I'm impressed. That was pretty cool. Um, I have a lot of questions. As you heard me say, I just don't know what was going on. <laughs> Usually with expansion packs or game packs and trailers that we get, you know, they have the nice little subtitles that it's like, ooh, create this, do this. Nothing. It's just like watching a trailer to a movie. I uh, just so many questions. So I think it's cool. I think it's definitely something different, something I was not expecting. I was not expecting a game pack or anything like this at all, not even on my radar, which is really cool that they're giving us new content that we've never seen before, but kind of still throwing back to Stranger Town or Stranger Town, Strange Town, and kind of like taking us back to that. And even in some of the Simgaroche treats, you can see with their little strange language type stuff that they was using it was like beauty 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 bella and calling bella the mother so i mean i think it's kind of like a link and a correspondence maybe to strange town hopefully they'll clarify on that a little bit and kind of give us their inspiration behind this and what this means but yeah my questions are are we getting a military career is this a town that we can actually live in um is this the the strange things that are happening with the sims like looking possessed 
Is that something that only happens in Strangerville, or is it something that affects Sims in other worlds? I mean, there's just so many questions. So many. But, I mean, that's really all the questions I have, just based on what they showed us. Um, which, like I said, I hope that they will clarify those questions that we have soon and give us more, which I really think that they will. But, anyways, in my opinion, I'm excited about it. I think it looks really, really cool, looks really fun, and honestly, here's my little rant, so just don't get mad at me if you are not excited about this, and I'm not attacking you or coming after you. I just think that there are some people in the Sims community that are never happy with anything. They like to complain, and they like to drag down the other Simmers who are excited about something. They like to drag down the sim gurus and it's just it makes you look like a spoiled brat and ungrateful and it just bothers me you know I wasn't expecting this it's not necessarily what I wanted but it's something I, I want that I never knew I wanted it wasn't on my radar like I said but listen we're gonna get university they've hinted at it we're gonna get university and they've hinted at a lot of stuff that we have been telling them you know they've hinted at cars they've hinted at babies they talked about these things all these things that we want they hear us, okay? We can't get everything at one time, you guys. They just can't. If, um, if they could, I'm sure they would give us everything we want at one time. But just be respectful in the comments down below. If you think this pack is going to be stupid or you're not a fan of it, it's your opinion. That's fine. You are entitled to your opinion. Truly, you are. I'm not going to be mad. But just be respectful because there are people like me who are excited about it and we're just a fan of the sims it doesn't matter what content they put out we're a fan and we're gonna buy it and we're gonna play it and so yeah just be respectful i don't want any negativity down in the comments leave your opinion yes but just be respectful that's all i ask but anyways you guys i'm gonna go now i have to get back to doing some recording for next week so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to see more videos like this with announcements and stuff or my opinions let me know in the comments down below and if that is something you're interested in i will kind of upgrade my quality camera because i'm just using my webcam right now because i don't really ever do face cam or anything like that but yeah so if you guys enjoyed be sure to give it a big thumbs up subscribe if you have not and with that being said thanks for watching love you guys and i'll see you